What's up, y'all, and welcome back to my channel. I'm your favorite girl, Diva. If you are new to my channel, you're most definitely welcome. If you're not new to my channel and you would day one, stay one. What's good with what it do? You already know what it is. But if you're new back to you, please subscribe to my channel before we go any further in this video. It does help me out a lot. Don't forget to like this video. Give it a thumbs up. And if you feel it, you know, give-ish, because you know it's the season of giving, share the video, because that helps me as well. But as you see in the title down below, I'm going to be showing you all the things that I got for Black Friday, as well as Candle Day, which is today. Candle Day, we're going to go ahead and start with first, because, girl... I had a time, I had a tough time, but nonetheless, I got what I wanted or most of what I wanted. So like I said, without further ado, we're gonna go jump right into Bath and Body Works. <laughs> okay. So I got my bag and everything, like the free takeaway bag. Most of the people wasn't really taking this. They were just using the shopping bags. So 2023 Candle Day Bath and Body Works, I got the bag. So obviously this is recyclable. I'm a recycling queen. So I will be reusing this bag for shopping. I got up this morning at 7 a.m. because the one next to me opens at 8 a.m. So I was like, going in there with the mind of I already know what I want. The line was out the door, girl. The line was out the door, out the door. And I should have known, I didn't think it would be because I was like, okay. I tried to shop yesterday and I have the app and it was mad, like the, the line was crazy. It was crazy. So granted, am I glad that I shopped today? Yes, because it was way less crazy. The app girls, we was up in there. So I already knew first things first, I needed fresh balsam, fresh balsam, whatever you want to call it. This is woodland balsam, eucalyptus, fir branches and cedarwood. I love this candle. This is my favorite candle. I'm trying to get you guys a good close-up. But girl, this is my favorite candle. And the candles are on sale for $9.95, which is $10. Usually, they're $26.95, $27. You know I had to double it. Shoot, because I usually go in there and just get two of them hoes. I got one, two, three, four, five. I got five. I got three, what is this called? Three fresh balsam. I got one rose water and ivy. This has rose, soft rose petal scents, English ivy, and lemon blossom. This smells so good. I also have these in wallflower plugins. It's really, it's sweet, but it's soft and sweet. It's not too sweet to the point where it gives you a headache. It's like a sweet that rocks you and it's like a hug. Oh, I love the scent. White gardenia. It smells so good to me, but it's so like, it's a scent that will stop you in your tracks, so to speak. But it's, it's not a, it's not harsh. It's another scent that's like, it's soft. You smell it, but it's soft. And it's like, oh, that's nice. It's almost like a spell is being put over you. <laughs> so this has gardenia petals, sweet apple, and white tuberose. And it almost like, this is something that you want to smell when you go to the spa. That's a great way to describe it. Now, fresh balsam. This right here, I could not find. I had to drive all the way to the mall. But I found it, so I'm not even going to complain. I'm just going to tell you what happened. This morning, I've been looking for the plug-in of this because this smells literally like a Christmas tree, an actual Christmas tree. They was like, we don't have that, but we can give you mahogany um, balsam. I don't want that, it didn't smell like the same. The only thing that did smell the same was balsam winter tree farm for sure. It kind of gives this, but it wasn't this. I needed this, this is my go-to. And I'll post the other one across the screen, screen once I remember it, but I was not going back home until I found this candle. Unless I had, I even had to go to the next city over. I needed this candle, I needed it. So I got three of these. I already have one at home, so technically I have four. But this candle is gonna last me a while since I got three. I'm not sure, girl, because I got a cruise coming up and I will be taking, I love taking candles on vacation. I just feel like that's a part of vacation. And don't let, oh, don't let it be a bathtub. Don't let it be, let it be, let, Quiet as it's kept. 
let it be a bathtub. But girl, don't let it be a bathtub because I'm going to clean it out and get up in the people thing at, at base. Soak. Not, oh, I can't wait. So anyways, let's get into our next thing, which is this cute little purse that I got from Ross. Let me come a little closer. So I got this purse from Ross dress for less or whatever you want to call it but this is bebe or bb the girls call it bb girl so i got this i think it retailed for 96 dollars but i got it for 17 dollars it was 16.99 because they had brought it down to 64 and then i got it on sale it was even cheaper so 16.99 or 17 17.99 i paid for it and I was like, you know what? I've been saying that I want to elevate my purse game. I want to elevate my scent game. I don't always want to smell like Bath and Body Works. There's nothing wrong with walking around smelling like Bath and Body Works. But you don't, I don't always want to smell like Bath and Body Works 24-7. I need to be more versatile. So I don't always want to rock a backpack 24-7. I need to be more versatile. So I thought this purse was really cute. You open it up. It has a whole bunch of compartments. My phone can fit it in there. My vape, my blunt fit in there all together. Chapstick fit in there. Mascara and the square. What's that eyebrow stuff? Anastasia Beverly Hills. The girls who know, know can fit in there. There's another compartment here as well that was fitting in there. I fit a whole bunch of stuff in here. Cards, cash. It's very roomy to be so small, which is the, my main thing on why I prefer backpacks is because I hate big purses. They remind me of my mama's suitcase. I meant my mama purses that she carry around. It has everything, everything in it. And she be... Hold this. Takes out jug of juice. Hold this. Girl, be like, I don't want to... I hate big purses. <laughs> I'm traumatized. She done sent me in her purse to get a few things and I, ain't, I came out two weeks later still didn't know what I went in there looking for. So... I found this cute small purse and it's a very cute color especially for the season that we're in and it was affordable so you know I had to grab it the next bag that we are gonna go ahead and jump right into is Francesca's I don't usually shop in Francesca's on the regular I do walk in there from time to time the one that we have in this store I walked into today when I was in the mall and they really didn't have anything so I was like, okay, it must have been because we were in a different area that I was able to find what I liked. So first things first, we're gonna start with this bracelet. The bracelet was on sale. This bracelet was $20.95, but the bracelets and the jewelry were on sale, buy one, get one. So I thought this bracelet was really pretty. It reminds me of the flowers from SpongeBob, which is really why I got it. And it's also very dainty, and I like kind of dainty jewelry. So, look at my rings. I got some rings from there. This one, I thought was really, mind you, it matches my nails. But I thought it was really cute. I'm wearing this one from there and this one from there as well. So, that leads me into my next thing. This is the ring set that I bought. <laughs> so, like I said, the jewelry was on sale. Buy one, get one free. And this one was $28.95. The jewelry was also half off. So that was good as well. The next thing that I bought was my favorite buy. Now, this was my favorite buy of the store. This was one of my favorite buys of the day. Almost, I can almost say because of how much I saved that this skirt right here, not only is it super cute, I do wish it had shorts underneath, which it doesn't, but that doesn't really matter because I can always buy some shorts if I'm feeling, yeah, it doesn't have shorts, but I can always buy some shorts if I want to, to go up under there. This is a size medium, and I just thought the skirt was really pretty. It's a very pretty skirt, and I got it on sale for $16, I believe. It was either $13 or $16. Here it is, okay. So, the skirt was originally $44. They marked it down to $24.98. And when I got to the register and the lady was ringing me out, she rung this skirt up for $13.48. Ah! I was like, 
I'm not finna say nothing. I don't know if she giving me the black discount because it's Black Friday, but I'm not finna say nothing. So I was like, mm-hmm, go, go ahead and wrap that up, girl. Put it in the bag. Hurry up before she changed her mind. <laughs> yes, let me show you the next thing I got, which is from Victoria's Secret. And I don't shop in Victoria's Secret often, but I wanna, like I said, I'm changing, I'm changing. I usually wear boxes and stuff like that, but it's hard to wear boxers at, on certain times of the month. And I like to elevate my style in general. So when I'm elevating one thing, I'm elevating everything. So I'm going from backpacks to purses. The backpacks ain't going nowhere now. They're still gonna be here. But like I said, I'm changing, I'm evolving. I want backpacks and purses. I want panties and boxes. I'm still wearing socks with sandals. What, what, what? Okay, first things first. Look, ah! this is so cute. Look at this toe I got. Okay, so this is a cute. Victoria's Secret. I would say this is a chocolate brown color. I love this. I don't care what it is. Ah! And on the inside, it's pink. Hmm. Hmm. Can you see that? It is a cute bubblegum pink. Oh my gosh, girl. This is going to be such a cute travel bag. Look at this. It's such a cute travel bag. So this runs for $59.95, but I got it for free. So technically this would have been $60 had I paid for it. But let me pull up my receipt. I spent $159.67 at Victoria's Secret and I saved $234.88, girl. Let's go ahead and get into it. And the thing was, if you spend $150, you get a free tote. So that's why I got the tote for free and didn't pay for it. So, first things first I wanna jump into is my negligee or my nighttime attire. This nighttime attire can easily transfer into a, a night on the town or a sultry girls night. The girls got me, the girls got me. The way this one girl, it wasn't everybody, but it was the way this one girl had hers tailored. Let me, hold on. Like, how, ah, how cute is this? And it's very, it, when I put it on, she was like, oh, that looks very, and girl, this is an extra small. They run big. This is an extra small. All the space. This is an extra small. So they run really big and you can still get it tailored to fit your body. I want mine to be like, mm -hmm. So I'm gonna take mine to a seamstress and she's gonna suit it up. So these are the bottoms. Y'all want me to put, put it on? All right, I'll put. Okay, hold on. Well, let me back y'all up a little bit, actually. <laughs> ah, this is so cute. Get into the details. This is so cute, y'all. So, this is the Victoria's Secret. I will definitely post, I don't know what it's called, but I'm definitely gonna post a picture across the screen. I'm gonna link it down below so you can buy it as well. But I thought this was really pretty. It was really, it is really pretty. I'm gonna get this tailored. Once you get this tailored, look how it's gonna look on your body, girl. Like, come on, are you serious? Are you see and the pants don't gotta be even touched. Okay, so next up we're gonna jump right into the bras. So the bras were on sale for $19.98, $20. They're usually $49.95. 
$50 a pop for a bra, girl. $50 a pop for a bra is a lot. So I got three. This is what they look like. I got teal, one regular black bra, and another blue bra with this V in the middle. I don't know what that is, but I thought it was cute. So we got that. Next we have panties. These I thought were really cute. Look at them, look at the little wreath. These are a nice lavender color, cheeky type thong. Let me see how much the underwear were on sale for. The underwear were on sale $5.50. They're usually $10.50. So that's really not bad. It really was a sale to be honest. The next underwear I got were these gray and purple lace panties. These are regular bikini type panties. And I know someone is probably gonna say you're not really showing the underwear. I'm not really trying to show the underwear because I know there are people on here that are kind of weird. So these are some black bikini underwear as well for regular everyday wear or that time of the month where you want some black underwear so you don't if you happen to mess up because it happens. I also got, I thought these cloth underwear were really cute. These are bikini underwear as well. So for the most part, I really just got bikinis and thongs. I thought these thongs were cute because they have my new initials on them. This is my last initial name or my last name. Let me turn it around. I'll take. So this thong was really cute. I really got this for my husband because my last name is now P, so I thought that was really cute. Now we're gonna jump into Alta and Sephora. Sephora first because I only got one thing from there. They really had a smaller Sephora in Mississippi, so I didn't get what I really wanted to get, but I definitely got what I needed. So I did get more Laura Mercier powder. This is a setting powder. I also wanted Huda Beauty and I wanted one size from Patrick Star. But like I said, it was a smaller store in Mississippi so they really didn't have a lot. But they had this, I'm used to this so I got this. I needed a setting powder. And that was all I got from them. So moving on to what I got from Ulta, starting with Starting with skincare items, I got, I love their face masks. These Tony Moly or Tony Molay is the brand. And I got the I'm Rice Clear Skin Mask. I got the Moisturizing I'm Aloe Mask. I got a Calming I'm Hemp Mask and another Clear Rice Mask for clear skin. I feel like this one really does work wonders for my skin. So I got two of those. And these were on sale, I believe, buy two, get two. So that's why I have four, because I usually just get two for the most part. I got this Baby Mario Badescu spray because it was on sale for $3.25. It was upfront by the register. As you see, I've already been using it. So this is the facial spray with aloe herbs and rose water. So hopefully that is, y'all can see that. And last but not least, I got, I had to get some primer girl. This is my primer that I use all the time, but they came out with a new one. So I'm gonna test this as well. This is the e.l.f. Power Grip Primer. This one has, which I never noticed before, hyaluronic acid. And I wanted to try this because it has 4% niacinamide. So I got two new primers. I needed to re-up on this one and I wanted to try this one in general. And let me, my receipt is in my email. So I'm gonna put how much I spent at Alta across the screen because girl, that's it. That's all, that's all I bought for Black Friday. And I'm really happy, I don't know. Thanksgiving was a bust, but 
Everything else after that was wonderful. I'm glad I spent time with my husband. I'm thankful I spent time with my sister because we, we really don't get to spend that much time together. But stay tuned for that story time. I'm so glad, especially if you stayed until the end. Thank you so much for watching my video. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe to my channel. And I will see you guys in my next video. Bye.